Hi, it's Ed from ACCA. On behalf of TEC, and what we're going to talk about today is manual T. Just to set the table for us, this is going to be a very concise overview of what is contained in manual T. It is the book we look towards for guidance on where the air coming out of the supply registers is supposed to go and where it's not supposed to go. One of the downsides historically is those terminal outlets tend to get picked based off of their appearance and not their functionality. And that's something that if you are guilty of it, I strongly recommend you do something to educate yourself on the topic. Manual T contains guidance that shows you how to select supply registers. It gives you information on how to read the engineering information from the register manufacturers. It'll walk you through the process of selecting a register that has the proper spread and throw. You'll learn about things such as terminal velocity, and it also gets into return grill selection which is a little bit easier, but it is definitely an important part of the design process. I'm going to go under the assumption that you've been in a house more than once that you hear what I generally refer to as the spaceship noise. You hear that woo, -woo, -woo noise and it's from the air passing across the grill at too high of a velocity and the, well, I guess the technical explanation is the metal on the register starts to vibrate and that's what creates that noise. When it comes to anything to do with grill and register selection, are all rules of thumb bad? And the answer to that is no. If you're making return grill selections, for instance, based off of rules of thumb, as long as the math that created the rule of thumb is good, then it's not a terrible thing. But what I would strongly recommend that you do is work the math out to make sure that you have enough free area so that we don't end up with those issues with registers that make noise. In my experience, the selection of the grills and registers ends up being the most overlooked part of system design. In many instances, their color, uh, their style is selected long before any of their performance characteristics are looked at. A case in point that I see rather frequently is these gorgeous wood supply registers that have been handmade to match a just absolutely stunning floor and if we don't get the throw and spread out of the register all that effort for appearance went to waste so with that uh, i'd like to think that i got you thinking a little bit about manual t and we'll look for you on the next video mm.